Event planning is a career some people love planning parties. They get excited weeks in advance, tending to every small detail and when the day of the function finally arrives, they make it appear as if it came together with a snap of the fingers. These are the type of people who make perfect event planning professionals. They naturally enjoy every aspect of planning and throwing a perfect event. There are event planning professionals in every major city. For a fee they will take your idea for a party or gathering and bring it to fruition. All without any worry or stress on your part. All you do is explain the outline of the event, what you hope to accomplish, your specific preferences and you write them a check. After that your job is done until the day of the event arrives and you attend as the host who appears completely organized. If you've planned major events with success such as your own wedding, the wedding of a friend, a family or high school reunion or even a child's birthday party, then you might be a professional event planner in waiting. For the people who do this for a living, it comes naturally to them. They revel in the details, and in the excitement of pulling it all together into an impressive event. If you think you might have event planning blood running through your veins it's worth pursuing, especially if it's something that you truly enjoy. You can talk to some local party planners in your area and get a better sense of what the job involves and if you have the credentials to get started. A background in either catering, sales or marketing would be a great foundation to start from, since the event planning business utilizes all three. Event planning with a group it's party time. You and a group of friends or associates have decided to band together to host an event. You gather together for an event planning brainstorming session and you can't decide on anything. Every person involved wants different things. Instead of planning the perfect party, you've spent hours debating something as simple as the design of the invitation. One of the positive benefits of event planning with a group of people is that each person can take on a role. One person can be responsible for invitations, while another tends to the menu and a third handles the decorations. The burden of the event planning is divided into sections and each person can place their full attention on one aspect instead of one person become flustered while trying to remember every aspect. There are drawbacks though when you have many voices all involved in the event planning process. Differences in opinion might create some conflicts and what one person suggests, another might discount. There are ways to handle the many varying opinions and still create a memorable event. One way is to decide on a voting method. If there are several people involved, you can agree at the beginning of the event planning process that majority wins. This can resolve any disagreements in a fair and reasonable way. When everyone has had their vote, the most votes win and the decision is final. Another really effective approach is to discuss everyone's strengths before the event planning discussions ever get underway. If one person enjoys menu planning, this area could be left up to them, if another is very creative, decorations might be their area of expertise. Utilizing people's individual likes and strengths can help guarantee not only a smooth event planning process but a highly successful event as well. This information in this video is for educational and informational purposes only. The content is not presented by a professional, and therefore the information in this course should not be considered a substitute for professional advice. Always seek the advice of someone qualified in this field for any questions you may have.